Yeah, catch him down bad, beat him with the bat, hashtag that yeah. I call the new jack, yeah, yeah, bitch, I got the blue jack, yeah I make that cash talk, I got a new house, you wanna get in, need a man coat, man 225 on that boat, man, stack it up, big dick Yo, before we even get into this video, make sure you guys be a part of the notification gang So you be the first to know when I drop that hot fire Like I said, hit that notifications up so you can be the first to know so I'm just gonna jump straight into the video. I'm not even gonna get no regular intro because I'm pissed off, man. Now it's a lot of stuff that's been happening over the last couple of days. We all know about people who place top 10 or top 11 or whatever it is. I think it's top 10 in the Mountain Dew tournament got bad. Now, to me, a part of me is saying it's about time. Then another part of me is saying like, damn, that's messed up. Let me explain myself. Now, to me, 2K has become one of the worst games out right now. Not just because of the devs, because the de devs, trust me, you guys have made this game terrible too. But because of the 2K community, aka the 2K fans, and because of the 2K Park YouTubers. Now, you can't blame the my team YouTubers, because they ain't had nothing to do with this. It's just the Park YouTubers. Those guys, some of these guys are so blunt about how they boosted to get this unlimited, unlimited boost. It makes no sense. These guys are heartless. Some of these guys are 100K talking about some. yeah, I'm boosting this week. Y'all come through, throw the game for me. Other ones try to be more subtle in it. And if I win, I'm doing a giveaway. What does that mean? That means the only way y'all can get a giveaway if he wins. So that he's basically telling you guys to come throw the game for him. That Saturday, bro, I, I log on to YouTube. I was getting ready to go ahead and play the job. I was like, yo, I'm going to hit my man Damage up. Shout out to Damage. His channel will be down below in the uh, description. Check him out, man. He about to be an SS4. One of the best players I've played with so far in 2K. So, um, I was getting, I hit damage up and damage hit me, actually damage hit me up, was like, yo, let's go ahead and play. And I was like, yo, I'm home, I'm about to go hop online anyway. So usually when I hop online, what I like to do is go to YouTube first to see what's happening. Because over the last couple of weekends when Mountain Dew came out, people was live streaming, telling people to throw games for them. So I was like, if there's too many people online, bro, doing that, I'm not about to play. So I hop on, I lie to you guys not. It was about... Seven to eight streams talking about some come through. If I win, I give you guys a giveaway. Come throw the game for me. Come do all this. So I was like, you know what? I'm not even about to waste my time. Because if you're not live streaming, if you're not a big YouTuber, it's impossible to win that. It's impossible. If you don't start exactly at 11 p uh it was it 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 9 West Coast time, like it's impossible to win, and it takes away from the fun. This game is all supposed to be about fun and being competitive, but niggas are out here cheating. They don't care. Niggas are on YouTube, they have videos on YouTube saying, yo, I don't care, nigga. I boosted for this. Who cares, bro? I don't give a... It's like, yo, really? So, then the devs want to take matters into their own hand because there are some people out there that are doing it legit. So instead of attacking the people who are out here on YouTube with the video still on YouTube, instead of hitting those guys with a 30-day ban, they want to ban everybody. So my thing is, what if I would have played? What if me and Damage would have got top 10? And what if I would have got banned? If I would have got banned, I swear to God, I would have strapped the bomb to my chest, went up to 2K, and blew that motherfucker up, bro. Because right now, I'm getting so tired. Not only of 2K, not only of the devs, not only of the archetype system, not only of just the how garbage this game is with animations, but the 2K YouTubers are really pissing me off, and also the 2K community. You guys are the one that convey clickbaiting. You can stop a nigga from clickbaiting, all you gotta do is not click on the damn video. But you guys are so gullible and so dumb that... When you see something, you don't even know it's clickbait until you click the video. That's why you guys be so mad afterwards. Now, a lot of my videos, you guys say the last couple VC is, is clickbait. It's not really clickbait. I'm giving you guys methods on how to get 
VC. You can get a million VC if you sit down and put your damn mind to it, but you guys don't want to do that. You guys want shit handed to you. You want me to pull, take you to the water and make you drink the water and then make you walk, or then walk your ass back to your house and lay you down for you. That's what you want me to do. You want to be spoon fed. My channel is not about to spoon feed you for nothing. You got to earn stuff. And that's what makes it so upsetting when niggas are really having dudes, having their fans to lose games so they can be uh, spoon fed unlimited glitches. Un I'm saying unlimited glitches. Unlimited boosts. Like, doesn't that irritate anybody else but me, bruh? What happened to being competitive? What happened to... Uh, showing that you the best by just beating everybody. It's just a game, remember? Y y these are the YouTubers that say, "Yo, this game is just a game. You gain some shit." Then why are you, why are you, why are you making it even worse? I don't get that. I don't, I don't get you niggas, man. I do not get you niggas. I don't think the 2K community is for me, bro. I need to go to Madden. I need to go on Madden because they more competitive. Let this happen on a EA freaking surf. Let this happen on Madden. Madden would have been banned you automatically bro this makes no sense 12 patches of bullshit devs giving us bullshit archetypes suck these all these archetypes suck like why doesn't the archetype match us up with the attributes the attributes say my man got a 93 three-pointer add a plus five boot that's a 98 three why is he missing threes but a playmaker's three is at like a 72 Add a boost to that, that's what? Five, that's a 77 at max. And them niggas are knocking down more threes than sharpshooters. How is that possible? How does somebody with a 55-3 hit a three in the corner? Green light. How is that possible? Like, this makes no sense, bro. I don't know how y'all can keep playing this game. I've stopped playing this game over the last couple of weeks. This game is garbage. This 2K community is garbage. Everything about 2K is garbage. Ronnie 2K, you supposed to, Ronnie and LD, they supposed to be the leaders of the community. They supposed to be monitoring the community. They're not doing nothing, bro. All LD, all LD do is play pro -am. Ronnie doesn't even play the game. That shows you how good he is at the game or how much he cares about the game. He doesn't even play the game. And then they, then they gonna ban people. Like, I understand why you banning people, but you... I understand why they did it, but they don't understand that everybody in the top 10 didn't boost for it. Why don't you sit down and watch YouTube since y'all supposed to be watching YouTube anyway? Because the people, they out here, they say, oh yeah, I'm boosting. I don't give a mother. I don't, come on, pull up on me. Bro, I'm, I'm just so tired, man. I'm tired of this, bro. I'm thinking about switching my whole theme of my channel around to something different, bro. Because I can't keep playing this game. I can't keep doing it. 2K, this stuff is garbage, man. Everything about this game is garbage. 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 From the dribble moves, from the, from the dribble moves, the shooting, the build, the community, the YouTubers, the devs. They, it's all garbage, bro. All garbage. All garbage. This is how you know it's garbage. When a dude that makes, he is known for making fake glitches, fake VC glitches. He has been proven that 95% of his videos are all fake. Are all fake. Can get a hundred K on YouTube. That's it. Enough said, bro. I've said enough for this video. I'm out. She went on the first day we met. She let me fuck all night.